He is one of the biggest names in the history of horse racing, winning seven Breeders' Cup races and several titles at Del Mar. And within just the last hour, Patrick Valenzuela pleaded guilty to battery. Good evening. I'm Steve Atkinson. And I'm Lindsay Pena. 10 News reporter Vanessa Van Hefti was in the courtroom. And Vanessa, a dramatic scene unfolded when a woman claiming to be his girlfriend stormed in. Yeah, the jockey's girlfriend blaming alcohol for this entire incident. Uh, Valenzuela pleading guilty to domestic violence here a short time ago, admitting to slapping his girlfriend across the face at a Carlsbad restaurant. Dubbed horse racing's bad boy Patrick Venezuela is a very decorated, a champion horse racing jockey. In 1989, he won the Kentucky Derby and the Preakness Stakes, a seven-time winner of Breeder Cup, Breeders' Cup races. His career, though, has been riddled with drug abuse allegations. He has been suspended by racing authorities eight times. His California license was permanently revoked in 2008 after a drunk driving arrest. He has been he's fined 28 times, either fined or suspended by racing authorities 28 times, and he's in the process right now of trying to get his license back. Witnesses in September called police on the jockey at Fidel's restaurant in Carlsbad after seeing him slap his girlfriend. The defendant then showed up in the parking lot where the victim was present and started banging on her window and she stayed in her car out of fear. He then drove away, returned to the restaurant where the victim was seated at the bar. He grabbed her arm and slapped her in the face to the point where her ear was sore and felt numb. And Valenzuela's girlfriend took the stand today in his defense, asking the judge not to enforce that protective order that prosecutors were asking here today. So a guilty plea. He's looking at three years probation, a fine and a domestic violence recovery program as well. 52 weeks of that reporting live in Vista. Vanessa Van Hefti, 10 News.